Check it. What is up guys, welcome to another video and today we are back on Need for Speed Pro Street for another episode of the Let's Play and like I said in the last episode, today is all about getting that 350Z. So since last episode, I've been making my way through all of these, I've been dominating all the events and now we have successfully unlocked the challenge uh, battle machine right at the top of the battle machine branch and the reward cars are the Golf GTI and the 350Z. Obviously, we're going for that 350Z and we're going to make it a drift car. That is what we're going to do here. Um, there's one event down here where you can actually use a drift car, but obviously we don't have a drift car to use at the moment, so we can't do that. But that will soon change once we have won this 350 over here at this grip race day. So that is the goal for today. We're going to go ahead and complete that, see where it goes, and uh, hopefully get the 350 and tune it. That is kind of the goal. So I will see you guys when we're at the race day. Okay, so we are now in the race day. We've loaded in and we've got all of the events right here. So we've got three grip races, two sectors shoot out and a time attack so I think first things first is we'll probably end up going into a grip race and we are going to use the 350 because I want to see how it how it, how it just generally handles and how it actually is in the game. Uh, once we have done that, we're going to go ahead and tune it, get it ready, uh, and then it will be our certified drift car for eventually when we get into the next showdown event. I believe we have actually unlocked the showdown event, but when I get this car first before we move on because it's kind of important to me and, you know, we can obviously use it in the future. So with that being said, we're going to go ahead and get straight into the first race, see how we do, hopefully we win, and take it from there. Yes. Okay, so here we are in the race. Huge lineup of cars, a mix of Golf GTIs and 350Zs. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and... Ah, uh, oh, don't hurt me. So since the last episode, I've really been going in with the Let's Play. Oh my god, you gave me like damage. Yeah, I've been really going in trying to uh, progress through Pro Street. Uh, and I've got a few things which I'll show you guys, you know, in future episodes which I've done. Uh, I haven't used any cheats or anything like that, don't worry. But, you know, I've got a few cool things to show you guys eventually, probably in the next episode. Um, but basically, once we get this 350, we're pretty much sorted. We've got a lot of money and we've got a lot of everything, really. So it's all about making sure we get this. Obviously, I've been using the uh, the 240 and this is so much more slidey than the 240 is for some odd reason and it shouldn't be because it's not even that much more powerful but it's so much more tail happy. It's a bit ridiculous. Okay, here we go. Final lap, final straight. Ugh, keep it, keep it tight. Oh, that wasn't tight. That was flat. Flappy. Flappy? Flappy. Right, keeping it going. We're going to reverse entry. No, we're not. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I don't want to die. So there you go. We won the race. <laughs> um, pretty easy, to be honest. I don't really care if it's easy. As long as we get the car, it's fine by me. Um, but we've got that race done. We're going to go on to the next one and uh, keep the ball rolling. Uh, right, we're going to go for something a bit different. You know, we're going to be winning the 350Z at the end, and I've, I know how that handles now, but I want to try the Golf GTI just to see how it is. So that's what we're going to go ahead and use in the next race. Look at that sexy girl starting the race. Yeah, I, I know she's a cartoon. I know it's not real. I know she's an animation, but... I mean, if she, if she was real, you try to tell me you wouldn't tap that. I, I I probably would. If I mean, this is a bad place to be in right now. <laughs> but don't think like you guys have like. Don't tell me you haven't thought like, whoa, come on, that was like, come on, like you would. I, I, right. So um, by the end of the first lap, we have pretty much dominated it. I, I'm I'm pretty pretty sure we're gonna get all of these. So. Again, should be an easy win in the bag. Maybe that maybe that girl at the starting line might be impressed and we can, you know, take her back to the crib and now. That's the kind of hell Yay, light damage. <laughs> Pro Street is racist. Ryan Cro Ryan Cooper is clearly a white character. I'm not white. I'm not white. I'm not sure if you, you've quite gathered that, but I'm not white. I don't I don't want to be white in the game. That's all I'm saying. Were, were Black Box saying that everyone should be white? Is that what they were saying? Because if that's the case, oof, we've got we've got issues. We've got real issues. Right, Nos, we're gonna go ahead and break through here. Bang! Yes, that is what you call cheating. Um, but regardless, we are now gonna come up to the final straight, finish off this race, and that will get us one step closer to that 350Z. Boom! You win. 
I've just realised that we've done three races and uh, we are still quite away, quite far away from the goal um, of dominating this event. So it might take a while. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do two events, uh, 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 do that off camera, and I'll be back after the two events to share with you guys and uh, try and get the rest of this done. Because realistically, I don't want this this episode to drag on for too long. So I'll put like a meme or something, you know, something here to 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 like do the thing you know <laughs> uh, ooh. I'm pretty sure that means we've unlocked the grip king already <laughs> anyway with that being said this should be the last race we do um, so I'm thinking we do the time attack and then we get the 350 and run, basically, is what I'm thinking. Uh, and that should be the end of that. So with that being said, we're going to go ahead, go straight into the last race, and see if we can do it in one race. Okay, so here we go. We are now at the starting line. Um, well, we were at the starting line. Now the race has started. And we are in the 350Z. Funnily enough, I've noticed this as I've been doing these races. The Golf GTI has two bars of NOS, as where this only has one. Interesting. Not going to lie. For a game that which came out in 2007, it does kind of, it does really hold up quite well. Like, well, better than I thought it was going to at least. Um, the frame drops are an issue. I'm noting that, noticing there's a lot of frame drops, but besides that, everything is uh, it's pretty good. The thing is, after the first lap, we should be leading because we usually overtake everyone. Um, after the first lap is where everything gets slightly more interesting because, well, as you can tell, it's kind of a bit more of a level playing field, I guess. We should still win this easily, as you can tell by the target time. We are 10 seconds in front, um, so it should be pretty easy. I think I might bump up the difficulty in the settings, if that is a possible thing to do. I'm not sure if it is. I think I have it on max at the moment, but if it's not on max, I will change that for the next episode. Okay, so here we go. Coming to the last few corners. Ah, oh, careful we don't crash. Careful we don't crash. This thing is still extremely tail happy and very hard to handle. Ow. I'm pretty sure that was the hood that we lost last lap. <laughs> um, yeah, it's still rather hard to handle, which is weird. Um, but that, that won't matter too much when we make it a drift car. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, we should have easily won this by now. I might as well skip to the end because I'm pretty sure this is just a done race right now. So that's probably exactly what I'm going to do. No! I'm going to kill myself. I had to do the whole thing again. <sighs> right, there we go. We dominated the race day. That took longer than it should have. And as you can tell, in my room, it's genuinely getting darker. That's how long it took. It took like five to six minutes. But we've done it. It's El Completo. It's finished now. And we get to do something. Oh, we won a progressive insurance total repair marker. So that's cool, I guess. Anyway, we don't care about that. We care about the car. Now, as you can tell, the aero on these cars are a hell of a lot higher than anything else we've had. And even the power and the handling are a lot higher than anything else we've had. And I, like I said at the start, we're going to cop that 350. So that's exactly what we're going to go ahead and do. We're going to steal that 350Z. Um, now we're going to go ahead and back out, see if we made any progress in any of the king strands, because I think we may have got into one of the grip strands. Um, and we're going to see, you know, just what we've done overall. Okay, so like I guessed, um, we do have the grip one. Not going to bother with it quite yet. Uh, we're going to wait on that uh, until we've unlocked like all the way down into the grip king. I think I want to do the kings 
all in like uh, in succession. So I want to do the Grip King, then the Drag King, then the Drift King, and then Rio right at the end. So we're going to keep that for later. We're not going to be doing that anytime soon. But we've got it unlocked, which is nice to see. And then if we go to the garage, we've got the 350, which is ready for customization. And we will do that in the next episode. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you go ahead and hit the like, subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. You guys have been awesome. Stay safe and peace.